Assalamualaikum and hi everyone, my lovely student. For this video, we are discussing self-practice 2.1b. This is uh, from 4, chapter 2. Okay, question number 1. Convert five, uh, four, five, 494, this 10, number in the following basis. From my previous video, <coughs> which is part 2, uh, I'll show you or i explain to you two methods to convert uh, base 10 to other bases, uh, which is the first one is dividing by using place value and dividing by using this value. Okay, for this um, solution, I will. I am going to use the second method, which is dividing by the this value. So this is uh, how we do it. Four hundred ninety-four. We divide by two, and we will get two four seven with the with the remainder zero. Next, divide by two with remainder one. Again, divide by 2, with reminder 1, divide by 2, reminder 1, until uh, we get 0. Alright, so uh, the answer, we read from the bottom to upward. So this is the answer for A. B. <coughs> 494 divided by 4. So, this is how we do it until 0. So, this is the answer for B. C. And this is the answer for C. Next day, we di uh, we're dividing the number with 8. So, this is the answer. And the last one, dividing the number by 9. So, this is the answer for e. Next question number 2. Convert each of the following number numbers to, num to the number base given in bracket so for a first you have to convert base 8 to base um, 10 then only you can uh, convert to base 3 so this is uh, the answer when you convert to base 10 next you divide with 3. So, this is the answer for A. So, I just go through uh, the answer of the rest of the question. So, this is the answer for B. C. Sorry. Okay, so this is the answer for D. <clears throat> Next, E. So this is the answer for E. And the last one, F. So this is the answer. Okay. 
is next question number three. Convert the value of digit five in the number one five four six to a number in base three. Okay, this one only for digit five. So the digit five value is thirty. So this number we convert this three by dividing the number by three. So this is the answer. Next question number four. Convert each of the following numbers to a number in this ten. Okay, my solution. Uh, a, this is a uh, base two. I convert to base ten first, and then I get sixty one. Next, I divide by 8. Okay. Same goes to question B. C. Okay. But if you remember from my previous video, I also show you the direct way. Okay, the direct way. Uh, to convert the number in base two to base eight, which is we divide, uh, we dividing the number like this. Okay, uh, this one we divide uh, like this. And then we do the table. Okay, uh, if you use that method, it's okay. As long as the answer is same as me. But in this video, I show you uh, the, the, the long way which is uh, convert to base 10 first and then uh, next only uh, convert to base 8. Okay? So, if you choose uh, to Calculate this to convert this by using uh, the direct way is up to you. All right. So for answer for D, so this is the answer for D, E, and F. All right. So next, question number five. Convert each of the following numbers to a number in base 2. As you can see, all are in base 10. Convert to base 2 also. From my previous video, I'll show you the direct way. Uh, how to convert this. So, I'm not going to show here. I just, I just uh, show you the answer. Okay. So basically, you can choose uh, to first convert this to base two for, uh, to base ten first. Next, you convert to base two, or you can uh, use the direct method, which I explained to you in my previous video. Okay. I think this is the last slide, but I want to show you how uh, we how we, we use calculator to solve this. Okay, so let me show you how. Okay, you can use your calculator to direct calculate if the question asks you in uh, paper one, paper one which is. You have four multiple choices. Uh, you have multiple choices. A, B, C, D, A, B, C, and D. So you can use calculator. Okay? But if this question um, in paper two, paper two, in paper two, you have to show all the working step, right? So you have to show the step how you convert. Uh, for example, 43 base 8 to base 2. 
okay uh, you cannot simply write the answer like this you have to show like my previous slide uh, this one okay first you convert to base 10 and then convert to base now I'm going to show you using calculator. So make sure to on your calculator. Press mod one two two time, and then you choose number three. Case here, choose uh press three. Okay, so D here mean decimal. Decimal number system. Uh, if you still remember from my one video decimal number system is the number that we use in daily life and decimal number system also base 10 okay so this is base 10 so as you can see here uh, DEC is base 10 which is decimal HEX this one uh, not include in your syllabus uh, this is hexadecimal hexadecimal is base 16 okay base 16 uh, which is we uh, not not include in your syllabus so we are not going to use this bin uh, represent binary binary is actually these two and OCT octa is base 8. So in your calculator, you can convert the number in base 10 to base 2 or uh, convert to base 8 or directly base 2 to base 8 or base 8 to base 2. Okay. So for the other bases, for example, base 3, 4, 5, uh, 6, 7, you cannot use calculator. You must use uh, manual. Lah. Okay. So, you say I want to convert this number 111101 base 2 to base 8. Okay. So, first, uh, press the button lock here. Okay. Next, I uh, uh, hit B here. B mean binary. So, this is base 2. Base 2. Binary base 2. So, you just press 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. 1, 1, 1, 1, sorry. 0, 1. Okay. So, this is the example A. And then, you press equal. So, this is the question. 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, base 2, because this is B, means here is base 2. You want to convert in base 8, you just press this button. Oh, button. So, oh, this is actually the solution for D. Let me choose uh, the previous slide, okay, this slide. Okay, so, as you can see here, this is 75, this because here got got O O here is mean this is base A. Okay. So uh, one 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 zero two. Okay. So this is base two. You press binary again. Then you write this and uh, you press this number one 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 zero. Don't forget equal button so this is 110 base 2 say you want to convert to base 10 so you just press uh, this button decimal button so uh, this one already convert to base 10 now you want to convert to base 8 so you just press uh, this button so the calculator will give you the answer in base Okay, uh, very easy to use calculator. Okay, I'll show you one last example. This question. So, this is binary, which uh, uh, base 2, so binary, so press binary. 
So press the number 1111 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0 111 1, 1, 1, 1, equal button. So this is the number in base 2. You want to convert in base 10? So you just press decimal. So it will give you answer in base 10. If you want to convert to base 8, and press this button. So the calculator will give you the answer in this okay, If you want to change this to base 2, then press the binary button again. So uh, it gives you in base 2. So I hope this um, you understand this, you understand how to use calculator. So if this, uh, this okay, you can use calculator for checking your answer and for direct calculation if the question uh, in paper one, okay, in paper one you can use calculator, but uh, there is a limit in a in your calculator which is only consists of base two and base. Only. So, if you want to calculate the number in base 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, you have to calculate manually. Alright, so that's all for this video. See you in the next video.